three teenage boys accused of the murder of Lester Mann John Donovan are appearing in court this morning. The trio, who haven't been named by police, are charged in connection with the death of Mr. Donovan, who was found injured in King Street on September 2. The incident was reported to police 10 days later and Mr. Donovan died on September 15. A fourth boy who was also arrested on suspicion of murder has since been released without charge. Speaking to the Mercury yesterday, a neighbor of Mr. Donovan, who lived in Newtown Street, said, he moved in two or three years ago, he was generally quiet and kept himself to himself. We would say hello and goodbye to one another. I thought I hadn't seen him around for a few days. What we learned during today's hearing in order has been named banning the publication of anything that identifies the three youths accused of murder. Bail applications will be heard tomorrow at Leicester Crown Court. A further hearing will take place on October 17. The chairman of the bench tells him he will be remanded into youth detention accommodation until a bail hearing, which will be heard at Leicester Crown Court tomorrow morning. Ahead of a further hearing on October 17, the third youth is then taken back into custody. That concludes the hearing. The first two youths have been taken back into the court's custody suite. The third youth, who is 14, returns to the dock and confirms his name and address to the court. Again, he is told he is accused of murdering John Donovan and that the case cannot be heard at magistrate's court. Bail application to be heard tomorrow. The magistrates will have to send the case to the Crown Court because of the seriousness of the charge. A bail application is to be held at Leicester Crown Court tomorrow morning. Sally Cook, prosecuting, briefly tells the court a male was attacked and died as a result of his injuries. The magistrates enter court and make an order that nothing can be reported that identifies any of the three youths. One of the three is removed from the dock and will be dealt with separately. The two remaining defendants are told that they are accused of murder on September 2.